Debate continues over a proposed switch to a parliamentary system of government, with former DPP Chairman Xu Xinliang weighing in on the issue today. She said Taiwanese are unwilling to give up direct presidential elections and believes instead that power should be balanced more evenly by enlarging and diversifying the legislature. Amongst those who took a conservative stance following the proposed constitutional reform was Vice President Wu Deni. Do the people of our nation have a strong consensus on what is the best system for our country? We can't have the turmoil that frequent constitutional revisions would bring. It would prevent the long-term peace and stability that we desire. The proposal to switch to a parliamentary system was initiated by new Taipei Mayor Eric Zhu, who didn't comment on the matter today. This is what former DPP Chairman Xu Xingliang had to say. In Taiwan, we know that we cannot eliminate direct election of the president. The president the people elect cannot be a figurehead. If we cannot have a figurehead president, then we cannot have a parliamentary system. Xu believes that the imbalance between the president's authority and responsibilities is due to the legislature not exercising its right to overthrow the head of the cabinet. He recommends a revision that would increase the number of lawmakers and decrease the proportion of votes parties need to obtain at-large seats. Xu believes this is the way to bring more voices into the lawmaking body.